Hi, I'm Gordy Sangpo, a physical therapist, and I have been practicing for 10 years now. Usually with plantar fasciitis, you often see this with clients who overuse their foot. For example, they're walking too far or they're running or jumping or jogging and they do it very frequent with a number of hours without a period of rest. Oftentimes, what happens is the fascia underneath our foot often gets overused. They experience an increase in stretch on those tissues, creating the signals of pain in our body. Usually, those pains are signals that our body needs some rest or the, the load or the capacity that your foot is experiencing is higher than uh, what your body can handle. The first step in managing the pain that they're, they're experiencing is to number one, understand what's causing their foot pain. Second step, once you understand what's causing their problem is to fix their symptoms that's, and fix also the root cause, both at the same time. If we zoom in in plantar fasciitis, what usually happens is if their foot doesn't have enough mobility, when they try to like land their foot on the ground, their, the foot needs to pronate or flatten. And then as soon as the foot will propulse on the ground, it needs to supinate or create that spring force on the foot for your leg to like move. Now with patients who are experiencing plantar fasciitis, their foot is really stiff. So you, you need to increase the mobility on their ankle and foot. And second, Oftentimes, the body also compensates, so you may find that the foot mechanics is really good and normal, but their hip motion or hip mobility is having some issues or problem. So you need to fix also the hip while also sorting out the symptoms of the foot.